Yo, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy back to watch more police. This is episode 351, continuing along. Uh, yeah, man, let's just get right into it, y'all. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you. I love you. You guys know all the announcements. Please comment, like, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications. Uncut early access of this will be on a Patreon YouTube memberships. Thank you all for watching with me. Let's get this thing going. A couple more episodes left, and we're done with the series on the Thousand Year Blood War. Yeah. Another restless night. That feels you. How many of y'all got restless nights? I be getting restless nights. Restless nights is a part of the fucking thing, right? As we become adults and whatnot, right? This cute birdcage here will be your training ground this time around. Uh, I can't help but think that going from a dollhouse to a birdcage is more of a downgrade. Yes, I will agree. Ready, steady playing the PSP. Do you know what the definitive difference between you and the rest of us is? Unlike us, you must acquire Fulbring through your own will. For you, understanding how to access your Fulbring isn't an occurrence that happens naturally as it does for us. That's why it's necessary for us to force you into physical and mental extremes in order to awaken this power in you. This trial by fire method is the only way we can ultimately help you to okay. regain your soul reaper powers. Sense. Understand? <coughs> Understood. Yeah. <coughs> I guess I'm stuck. I'm running out of time here. I'd say that the best way to bring out my powers is to let me fight one of you. Ichigo goes right to it. Ichigo Don't goes right to it. You have to learn your limits. But it's Ichigo. Where you're at now, Mr. Chicken here can easily take you out. If we don't take this slow, you won't survive much longer. I appreciate the thought, but I've never gained any strength by playing it safe during training. True. You're in this really big rush just to get it over your head. That's because there are people I want to protect. Yep. I can't just stand around doing nothing about it. So you feel like you can't stand around doing nothing. Well, you just might be right. So let's double up your training then. But you understand if you die, we're not to blame. Right. What do you plan on doing next, sir? Yeah, he's just chilling and reading. Excuse me. Well, you know, uh, are we going after Ichigo Kurosaki or Yasutora Sato? <laughs> well, look at that. <clears throat> you distracted me just as I was getting to the good part. Oh. I need you to do me a favor. Are you ready? This guy wants <laughs> to fight us? Well, you can count me out. I don't see the point in helping him. I'm against it as well. Mm -hmm. And why is that? <clears throat> I can understand why he wants to rush things along here. But the faster we progress this young man's training, the more intense will be the strain upon him. It's quite possible his power could become completely unstable. I can see that. All of us here except Mr. Kurosaki understand what that would result in. It would be his death. Precautions should be taken to assure that it happens naturally. I agree. Yeah, you have to admit he makes a valid point. That's besides the point. You claim you want to protect people that are dear to you, right? Those are noble words. But if you ask me, you're just a careless, egotistical brat who jumps into situations without realizing that you're gambling with your life here. Yeah. You know, sooner or later, we'll need Jackie's help with all of this. I agree with you. Pardon me. This time, Gariko's powers will take effect in only 10 minutes instead of 15, so be careful. Right. They're talking into it. Let's get to now, this. Now, I permit you. Get it right, you Mr. Chicken, you pork rind. Jesus, <laughs> like that's any better. Hi <laughs> there, I'm Mr. Chicken. It's a pleasure. Oh, God. Like, any of this is any better, right? Did Kugo send you? Yes. Miss Jackie, you know he needs us, don't you? When you get to be my age, you learn to live with things that disgust you. Wow, that was really on point. It's just that I haven't been able to get myself to embrace my powers. What Orihime says More mysteries. Is that like, for real. The person after us possesses the ability to manipulate memories? 
I wonder if the attacker who slashed Uryu is the same one who slashed Orihime. 100%. We already been through this. I said, you haven't been through it. We know this. Are they after so, him? So, am I their next target? Pretty much. Who's there? Kugo. What is it? Do you feel it? That spiritual pressure. You mean Chad? Did something happen to Chad? If you don't pay attention, you'll die! Calm down. I'll tell you what's happening. Someone's spiritual pressure is closing in on Chad. Someone? You mean... It's that guy again. Kincho, let me out of here! I have to go help Chad! I can't. Don't forget that you can't get out of there until you take out your opponents. Yeah, Damn it! That's not a priority right now! It is Chad's now. in danger! If Chad were weak, I'd be rushing over there right now to help him myself. But he's fine, so we should keep doing what we need to do here. First he says he wants to train so that he can protect others, but then decides to quit the moment he hears a friend is in danger. This is all about his selfish desire to play the hero. Ouch. What? You get there in time, but then what? Since you barely know how to full bring, you can't help him at all. Exactly. You're too impulsive. That's why I don't want anything to do with a wannabe hero like you. If I just stay in here without at least trying to help out, I'll be left with nothing but regret! <laughs> Ouch. That boy knows how to fucking talk you into that. Like, ugh. I love this fucking tune. Fine then. If you want to go, then go. I couldn't care less. But if you want to get out of there, then do it yourself. You gotta, you gotta kill them, guys. Now they're upgrading. <laughs> That's fucking weird, dog. I guess this means I'm not going anywhere unless I can find a way to defeat these two clowns. Yep. If I charge it with more spirit energy than I did with Getsuga. Do this. Let's go, buddy. There we go, buddy. You learned how to produce that much destructive power in such a short time. Impressive. I'm done. So now I'm gonna go help my friend. You go, boy. You go. Hold on. Uh, yeah, I'm fine. I was followed, but I was able to lose him. I think everything should be okay for now. All right. Glad to hear it. So don't worry about me, okay? Just continue on with your training. Yeah. That was weird. I know I was followed, but that was it. I didn't have the feeling that I was about to be attacked. What was that? I expected to hear you whine a little more. What's up? Nothing. Let's just do it. Fine. Here we go. Welcome. Ah, so it's you. Not giving me a plushie this time, huh? That's because we figured that you've moved past fighting them. I'm Jackie Tristan. You ready? Let's go with the girl. Ichigo Kurosaki. I sure as hell am. Aren't you going to attack? You haven't shown me your full brain yet. You need to see me as your real enemy. Would you have said the same thing on a battlefield? Yeah, I would. Unbelievable. <laughs> All right, I'll start. You guys don't know who the fuck this man is? Do you realize he boots. fucking killed Aizen? Oh, what is he doing? Okay. 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 It's getting nice. It's getting dicey. Loving it. Love it. It's nice and icy. All right. Uh, okay, so training. We are going through a training arc again. Understandable. You guys know how I feel about training arcs, right? It's like, I, you know, you just make them short. Don't, 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 don't make that shit go out for episodes, fam. Because that shit is travesty. It's devastating. Just training over and over again, bro. Hence why, like, my hero academia, I was like, how much more training do these kids got? I get it, they're in school, but fuck. Y'all make a whole fucking training arc game about this shit. It's nuts. But, uh, oh well. Either way, you know, I understand why uh, training has to be done for this situation. I just hope it doesn't last that long. You know, full bring powers, I get it. Something completely different. He's harnessing something out of the norm that he's used to. He has to get used to it. And, uh, 
yeah, you know, we, we got to we gotta have a little bit of padding in there. We, we can't just have it be so easy for him, right? Um, got a little a good look into Jackie Tristan. Um, she's great so far. Uh, I don't know what her power is. She just said dirty boots or whatever. So that seems kind of like she about to... I feel like she's about to fuck Ichigo up. <laughs> we'll see. Ichigo always finds a way. That's why I love Ichigo, man. He always finds a way. He's always like, he's always a cut above the rest. He's just naturally that talented, you know? Um, so right now, uh, Tsuchima and Tsuchigawara, if I'm correct, I, I hope I said their names correctly, are basically playing fucking stock. They're being stalkers. <laughs> they're like stalking our, our squad. That's all they're doing right now. I don't know what they're playing with. I, I don't know if they've even got to. Chad, yeah, but they were, they, you know, they, they were stalking over him, man, now they stalking Chad right now, and I'm just like, what the fuck? Uh, one of my favorite things that was said here was said by, I forget, the, the butler guy, I forget his name, when he said, uh, you know, at the age that I am, it's more, far more, said, you can, you, you, you what is it? I'm going to have him say it, what, what did he say? He said it way better. Okay, hold on. Age. You learn to live with things that disgust you. Fam, I feel like that sometimes. Because it's like, yeah, you, you know, like, I feel like when we're old, when we're younger, you know, we're very innocent and naive, you know, just, just like the world in general. And we are, I mean, I mean and, and, and most of us are because, you know, we were definitely protected by our parents and whatnot. You know, a lot, some of the world out there is a little bit harsher than, you know, I feel like a lot of us have lived in the United States. I, just in general, like, I just feel like, I mean, who knows? Who knows? Who knows what situation you're in? But like, for a good amount of us, I feel like uh, you know we grew up very naive, very protected by our parents, coddled that the world is going to be this this bliss, this this amazing, beautiful, beautiful thing, and it is. But things do turn shitty. You know, there are very disgusting things that people do, and sometimes that you end up doing yourself. You know, and uh, it, you know, the older you get, you just kind of get learn to just kind of like live with them. You know, it's, it's not like you can like get rid of it. It's not like you can. It's not like uh, I don't know if you guys have seen the uh, movie. Uh, oh my God, something of the spotless mind. Or the Jim Carrey movie. I'm gonna look this up. <laughs> so I don't look like an idiot. Spotless mind. Eternal sunshine of the spotless mind. It's not like you can just go in there and take a memory out and not learn to live with them. You end up living with the disgusting shit you do or the disgusting shit that people do to you. And you just kind of just like, just, you know, some people cope with it in many different ways, whether it be, you know, any kind of vice from overworking yourself, working, you know, exercising, alcohol, drugs, you name it, fam. You know, you just kind of learn to live with it. Shit. Prayer. Fuck, you just do. I, I really, really took uh, I took notice of that line, and I, and I very much, like, agree to it a lot. Uh, we saw the chicken man, Mr. Chicken. Mr. Chicken and uh, <laughs> Porky again. That was uh, interesting. Nice little fight between Ichigo and those guys. Ichigo obviously came, up, came out on top. Uh, yeah, man, the series is winding down. I'm ready to get down to the thousand-year blood where I don't know how. We got, like, I think I got, like, probably, like, good, like, 12 episodes, 12, 13 maybe episodes left, and then I'm done. Uh, hoping these episodes we get a nice little, I don't know. I've, like I said, I've heard mixed reviews about this area. So far, you know, I came in it very, very reserved. Now I'm enjoying it. It's good to see where this is going, but I'm still hoping that it doesn't, like, destroy or just take away what we witnessed with Aizen. Because the series is ended right there, man. I would have been fine with it. That shit was sick. It was so well done. Uh, but yeah, let's see where it goes. Thank you all for watching. I appreciate you. I love you. Like I always say, please take care of yourself, your families. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.